Tell me your journey on growing, developing, improving as a sales professional and this concept of value in our association. Tell me how that journey has unfolded. When you're with more product related companies early in my career, your impact and the way you view value is somewhat limited to solution only. It's like you're going to find the features that match this solution. I think as I've grown and both had you know, a few uh, early stage companies, the one I run now, your value and your delivery of that value is expansive. Now I think working with ecosystems, we now have a much broader structure and certainly the work you're doing with Bain, which is groundbreaking, being able to have levels and the pyramid of value for a, a sales professional to follow does take a lot of the guesswork out of it. Mm. But you have to broaden the conversation, but first you have to understand the buyer's perspective and the true value drivers for the buyer. And I think that's, that's something I've had to grow with, uh, as, especially in consultative selling, Chad. We don't sell a product. We're selling know-how and expertise, and we're selling our ability to deliver in a more specialized way. There is no feature function or demo right. currently. You know, right. it's, it's your content and your expertise, and it's the delivery of that. How do you put value or help the customer recognize value in content and expertise? Because those could seem in, invisible, less tangible to a buyer. Yeah, I, I think you got to show them both, whether it's a business case or a referenceable, deliverable that they can relate to. So for us, at, in, you know, in our stage of selling, it's how can we help a customer understand value in time and value in quality of those deliverables? And that's part of our work with ecosystems, you know, mm -hmm. really taking people through, clearing that value process up.